They spread rumor about you, have they? If they haven't, ah, you're not lucky enough. Someone has to have said something about you that's not true. That, and just for you to be given the opportunity to deal with it in a correct way or in a wrong way. Deal with it in just say, Alhamdulillah, mashallah. You know, the other day someone sent me uh, a message with a great accusation. And they told me something about myself. You won't believe what I did. I didn't know what to say. I said, Alhamdulillah to myself. But I said, should I reply? Shouldn't I reply? And you know, sometimes we get a little bit uh, upset in the sense that I want to tell him, hey, look, keep quiet. What you are telling me does not bother me. Just leave it. But because this person was being very hurtful, I decided to do something that would also hurt, which I don't know right or wrong. Maybe you can think about it when I tell you. I googled uh, a link, how to fly a kite. And I found a YouTube link and I just clicked on it, copied it, pasted it, posted it to this person. How to fly a what? A kite. What does that mean? I told him, just go to hell. Don't think you are going to bother me. Learn to fly a kite and fly it. Khalas. I don't even need to say anything to you. Fly a kite. And wallahi, that's the attitude. You know your link with Allah. You know when someone is wrong, they will correct. When you are wrong, they will correct you in a good way. Subhanallah. But you also know that there are people who will insult, accuse, abuse, try to assassinate character. Just leave it. We are living in an age of social media. Social media is to be taken not with a pinch of salt, with a bag of salt. Subhanallah. A whole bag, a spoon every day. Subhanallah of salt. That's social media. You can't take it seriously. The stupid have been given a voice through social media. You must remember that. The people who have no internet, the IQ is minus 10. They are there on Twitter. Subhanallah. They are there everywhere to say the worst things. If you are walking, they will say the worst things about you. But that's Allah is using them for destructive things because they have not been chosen by Allah to do constructive things. So thank Allah.